Look at that. Tactics. to gain like a lot of perspective about the kids I'm working with. More patience, um, just finding out that it's going to be trying because sometimes campers don't want to do things and stuff like that. Patience and to learn how to successfully light my lantern. A deeper understanding of my faith but also um, to use that and have a deeper relationship with campers. Grow connections with my campers and uh, co-staff and counselors the ability to push myself more out of my comfort zone. Uh, sense and a feeling of like contentness and like happiness. More understanding of how to help camp work behind the scenes because I'm doing more program work. Confidence and like being able to take care of kids because I haven't really worked in a role like this before. A really nice Chaco tan and a Deeper appreciation for God's creations and my surroundings. A deeper connection with God through my campers, along with a better connection with my campers. This Walk, summer, uh, or something. Uh, just, working I'm here always, is less I'm about gaining something for me and more about um, giving something. Okay. I feel like this is one moment in my life where I really feel like I am actively doing God's work. More faith this summer. Um, yeah. Uh, and maybe like a deeper understanding about God and the Bible, and uh, learn some of the famous recipes in the kitchen also. My name is Meatball. Um, I run the program here, uh, which basically means a whole lot of things, um, but I work directly with the summer staff team, especially the counselors and the program team members. From my experience as a, a summer staff member, I didn't find a place in my life where I experienced God more vividly than here. And I'd been to other camps, but there was something about Bethany Birch's and the like culture of the staff team and also the, the campers that we have that built this beautiful space of um, support while also being like challenged and growing. In addition to many other benefits, it's a supportive, caring environment. Uh, most staff have multiple meetings a week with our supervisor, with each other, so that we can be a cohesive team, which is, which is fun and supportive. I would really like to be a staff member because coming here as a camper, I had a really fun time here, and I'd really like to share that experience with everyone else. Camp has had a big impact in my life, and I want to um, provide other campers with that same experience. I think just like being able to spread the love and um, just our mission here at BBC. I just wanted to be a part of the community more than just a camper. My hope is to become a counselor and give back to all the kids and have the greatest experiences that I've gotten to have and grow in their faith like I have and just have so much fun because that's what camp is all about. So in recent years, mental health has become a little bit more of a struggle, or, or we're talking about it at least more than we have throughout human history. And I, I found uh, an article by Stephen Baskin, and he argues in his article that summer camps have the exact kinds of features needed to help reverse the two trends that have driven much of the mental health crisis, overprotection in the real world and underprotection online. Camps are a part of the solution because they take devices away from young people and place them into enriching face-to-face -face communities that foster mental, physical, and emotional strength. I mean, the same is true for the camp staff. It's, it's happening with the, the campers. It happens with the camp staff. And so that's one reason to be part of a camp staff. Your mental health might get better. I think I often see a lot of like personal growth in people in how they like approach um, problem solving and how they uh, take on difficult moments. I get to watch staff like grow in their like strength as they're on staff uh, and I think it's because this is a space where like 
we do want you to grow and that's pretty intentional and and we want to push you and we want to like have you be a part of that growth and at the same time like we want to support you and be there for you and that's something that I felt when I was on staff and so uh, I feel very passionately about that continuing to be a reality here at camp. I'll get this I was reading um, in the uh, the American Camp Association has a blog and and starting in 2020 they began a research study uh, in which they found that uh, the camp environment can be really nurturing for a young person's career path. And I think that's something that we don't talk a lot about because we think at camp it's fun, you don't get paid super well necessarily, um, and, and it doesn't sound like it's going to help with future planning, future jobs, career path. Um, but that's contrary to the data. The data shows that um, that it's actually really helpful. You learn skills that employers desire. And uh, so that's super cool. Oh, you know another thing? This property is awesome. It's really nice. It's uh, filled with wildlife, water, views, mountains. Super cool. Well, I've gained some new skills in repairing things and kind of just ex expanded my abilities in um, this realm. This summer I think I have learned a lot about leadership um, and how to motivate people to lead and also the, uh, just the different styles of leadership. I think I'm learning more about that um, and I think I've also learned a lot about inviting people to use the gifts that they have and when everyone offers their gifts, it makes this like beautiful group that can do a lot of things that we couldn't do on our own. This summer, I think I gained a lot of new experience, just in new skills with confidence and like being more of a leader this summer.